Prison is not just meant to punish offenders, it's also meant to rehabilitate them. That's the idea behind the Department of Corrections program where inmates learn how to train dogs. News 13's Jared Sellers joins us live in our studios. Jared, is this like an obedience course? It is, Tom, but the program supervisors say the two-legged and four-legged graduates are actually learning from each other. From the Northwest Florida Reception Center's Top Dog Training Program Friday. It's second round of furry friends trained by inmates at the Washington Correctional Institution. Bay County Animal Control partnered with the State Department of Corrections in December. The dog spent 10 weeks with inmates learning to obey commands. Animal Control officials say the learning is a two-way street. So the first couple of weeks are um, the care and handling of the animals, canine care. I think that pretty much is more inmate focused. Um, it teaches those inmates what they're looking for um, while they're while they're looking over the animal for any kind of wounds any kind of issues that the animal may ha be having that's the first phase during phases two and three inmates are teaching the dogs conditioning and socializing once they graduate the dogs will go back to Bay County Animal Control for adoption Lynn Haven resident Justin Smith didn't hesitate to adopt Apollo yeah he's getting trained by inmates and we actually did, you know, look at some other dogs too, uh, but eventually we were like, we, we have to, we have to put an application on him because, you know, it's everything I've, I've always wanted. I've always wanted a German Shepherd. Out of the seven dogs recently graduated, five are already adopted and two are still looking for a forever home. Still have two here at the shelter um, up for adoption. That's going to be Luna. She's a bulldog mix. And then there's Roxy, who is a hound dog mix. Um, both of those dogs are here. Um, again, um, obedience trained and ready, ready for their forever families. If you're interested in adopting Roxy or Luna, go to mypanhandle.com for details. Cute dogs. Jared, how often do these classes take place? Animal Control officials say they'll be sending another group of dogs to the correctional institution next week. They should be ready for adoption by the end of September. So pretty often. All right, Jared, thanks very much. Jared Sellers reporting live in our studios.